When an allergen is introduced to the immune system via the skin, uh, a breakdown in the skin barrier, that can be a real risk factor for development of allergy. And so that was actually one of the early observations that led to the seminal work in 2015 known as the LEAP study, which showed that if we actually introduce that allergen to children by mouth, having them eat it, before they're introduced to it via their skin, we can reduce the risk that that, that child's going to go on to develop the food allergy itself. Uh, several hundred children, they were randomized to either early peanut introduction or normal peanut introduction. And what the authors found is that the rate of peanut allergy was significantly lower. Uh, the long-term data suggests up to 70% lower in the children that had the early peanut introduction. You know, hindsight's 2020. It would have been nice to recognize this earlier and, and implement it even faster. At the same time, this is probably the biggest public health success in allergy in the modern era, um, I would say. Uh, you know, what our data shows is that because of or at least associated with those early introduction guidelines, there's about 60,000 less kids with food allergy today than there would have been.